If your makeup ends up looking like this every time, then you need to follow this brown girl's guide to perfect makeup. Grey foundation is the biggest culprit of a patchy and discolored base. What you need to do is pick up a foundation that matches your undertone and your skin tone. This is how your ideal foundation shade should look like. Blend this out and you'll automatically see the difference. Covering up discolored or pigmented under eyes without any color correction beforehand can end up looking like this. Start with an orange color corrector under the eyes and around the mouth before going in with a concealer. Now follow up with a concealer that is only slightly lighter than your foundation to help you brighten under the eyes and mouth. Remember not to choose one that is too light, otherwise it'll end up looking grey. Set your makeup in place using a warm toned loose powder. Translucent powders can end up washing you out and undoing all the perfect foundation and concealer matching. If you find yourself reaching out for those bright red and pink blushes, here are some tips on how to use bright colours without it looking like school annual day flashbacks. Pick up some product in your brush and diffuse it in your hands a few times before applying it. This will ensure that you apply a small amount of it and are able to blend it easily. The perfect way to add some depth to your makeup is by simply defining your brows with a darker pencil. You can see it for yourself that this step makes a big difference in your makeup. If you're a kajal lover, then this hack will help you use your kajal to open up your eyes rather than making it small and dark. Use your kajal under the top lashes, right on the waterline. This helps your lashes look naturally thicker and adds depth to your eyes without the fear of it smudging and making your under eyes look even more dark. I've found that any light pink or pale shades tend to wash out our red skin tones and make us look dull. Rather than these, you can go for deep mauves, brick reds or classic pink tone nudes that are perfect for Indian skin tones. This will really help brighten up your overall look. So these were my tips for every Indian makeup beginner out there. I hope these work out well for you and do let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Until then, stay tuned and stay glamorous.